See, when you're living in a big city like we are in here, right? We're basically in the middle of the CBD. All right, you can see a rig here over there. You got my building on the other side. And we're lucky we have a, a couple of beautiful trees around, right? But if you're like me, right? You like to hustle and bustle, right? You're busy with work. You want to you wanna create some things for yourself. The number one thing you can do for yourself is to be able to stay focused, to get out of stress, right? And how do we fi figure out ways that we can snap ourselves out of all these like stressful situations that all hit us, right? Peak hour traffic is coming out there right now, right? We're gonna go home, the kids, sport, hobbies, right? All these things that we actually wanna do with our life, it creates a lot of stress in our life. And same for me. So another one thing that I do is like, I'm in nature. I try to get into nature every single day. We did as walking around the lake, right? Getting, getting away from my, my, my usual environment, right? So what I was saying, right, is like, what do you actually do with your work and these sort of things that if you feel stressed and, and you know, overwhelmed and these sort of things, what I created for myself, I created a little stress schedule time slot for myself every single day. Meaning that every single day before I'm knocking off work and what I'm doing, I'm sitting down and then I'm asking myself these three questions, right? Number one, what are all the things that create stress for me right now around me, right? What are all the tasks that's creating these stress moments? What do I need to do, right? I need to call them, right? I need to have this project finished. I need to create this client work. I need to do all these sort of things there, right? So number one, I figure out what are all the things I need to do. Number two is that I'm writing out what are some action steps that I can actually take right now in order to solve these things tomorrow, right? And then number three, you might think about, but what are all the things that I can't control? What are all the things that I don't have an immediate solution to, right? How do I build my business stronger, right? How do I just get my body from where it is right now to where it wants to be, right? Like I want to lose how many kgs. Like we don't have an immediate solution, an immediate instant gratification to that, right? We can't complete it right now. So number three, you're saying to yourself simply, all the things that you don't have an immediate solution to, quit it. Put it over here and then say to yourself, hold on to the fundamentals of faith. Right, hold on to the fundamental of faith. Meaning that all the things is going to happen if you're just doing step one and two every single day. You're moving towards the things. But the most important thing for you is that you're taking all that stress and all these things out of your mind every single day. And you do that by getting it down on paper. It's a stress-free calendar, right? Slot where you're sitting down and be like, okay, what are the things I need to do from tomorrow? What are some action steps that I can do in order to accomplish these things tomorrow? And then number three, all the things that I don't have an immediate solution to, push it aside and then say to yourself, it's going to happen. If I'm just holding on to the fundamentals of faith, it will happen because of the things that I'm doing every single day. So again, that's just some of the things that I'm doing on a day-to-day -day basis. I've been doing a lot of work, right? Business-wise, my body being an athlete, right? Been in business for myself and done things, right? So I needed to figure out ways to not get overwhelmed, to not get stressed, to not get frustrated with the certain things there, right? So that's just one of the things. So if you have that right now, get out in nature and then do your list.